chemical properties of first a group elements so in that first one reactivity reactivity or reaction reactivity with oxygen a reaction with oxygen the first a group elements general the first a group elements are react with oxygen produce oxides comma peroxides and superoxides okay three different types of oxides are produced from first a group elements oxides peroxides superoxides so generally the lithium metal so there is a first a group element first metal the lithium is reacted with oxygen produce lithium monoxide so means lithium oxide next to sodium is reacted with oxygen in limited air in presence of limited air means less amount of oxygen in presence of less amount of oxygen it forms sodium oxide whenever sodium metal is reacted with oxygen in excess air so means more amount of oxygen here in sufficient air here sufficient at a more amount of air in presence of more amount of air it forms peroxides that is sodium peroxide na2o2 and next one rubidium is reacted with oxygen it forms rubidium ox rubidium peroxide rbo2 means the rubidium and cesium so generally we are consider metal here m is reacted with oxygen forms mo2 so this mo2 is called as nothing but your superoxide okay so this is also superoxide rubidium superoxide this is peroxide sodium peroxide so means different oxides are produced from a first a group elements oxides peroxides superoxides okay here m is nothing but your rubidium and cesium so means the in oxide nature the nature of oxides from top to bottom especially for peroxides and superoxide behavior is increases but oxide behavior is totally decreases so this is your reactivity with oxygen a reaction with oxygen and second one is second one reaction with water reaction with water means the first a group elements metals are dissolved in a water forms hydroxides so those hydroxides are for example metal is dissolves in water produce metal hydroxide m plus oh minus so means metallic hydroxides are formed and liberation of hydrogen gas for example sodium is dissolves in water forms sodium oxide naoh plus h2 so hydrogen gas is liberated means the metals are dissolves in a water at a higher temperature it produce hydroxides and liberation of hydrogen gas so after the reaction with water we discuss another chemical property that is reaction with reaction with halogens reaction with halogens so metals are react with halogens 
produce metallic halides so generally the first year group elements most of the first year group elements are forms ionic halide ionic halide for example sodium chloride or potassium chloride rubidium chloride cesium chloride so means most of the halides are ionic halides so ionic halides are easily soluble in water for example sodium chloride is easily soluble in water so that is ionic halide so solubility in nature is more so soluble in water and next one but lithium metal is forms covalent halide forms covalent halide in first year group elements except lithium element except lithium metal remaining all metals are forms ionic halides except lithium forms covalent halide these covalent halides are insoluble in water and these are kept in a environmental in hair condition these are easily exposed nature due to that the lithium metal is kept in kerosene petrol because whenever the captain kerosene and petrol these are not exposed in nature okay so because the lithium metal is very more reactive element when compared to sodium potassium metals so these are the reactive reaction with halogen and after that so we discuss reduction process are reducing nature reducing nature reducing nature means so the metals generally metals are exist in solid state your s indicates solid state so the metal m means metal metal exists in solid state it is converted to directly converted to gaseous state that is your vapor state v means vapor so the solid state of metal is directly converted to vapor state of metal without liquid state so this type of state is this type of reaction is called as sublimation process or sublimation energy okay that is our first step and second one is the solid state of metal or the gaseous state of metal is last one electron it converted to m plus 1 and lose one electron okay means the metals are electro positive metals this is easily donate electrons so here loss of one electron so the loss of electrons are takes place so such type of reaction is called as ionization energy it required energy is called as ionization energy so means the metals are easily undergoes reducing nature based on sublimation energy or ionization energy or hydration energy we already with the previous topic in, in previous physical property we discuss hydration process means what is your hydration energy from top to bottom hydration energy is decreases because due to increasing of atomic size means lithium shows more hydration power or more hydration energy compared to francium or cesium so this is your chemical properties in that first one reaction with oxygen next reaction with water and reaction with the halogen and reducing nature